Pedaway gets away and he flies in for the dunk. Take the lead right at the end of the first quarter with Pedaway's second slam dunk of the game. Calpellas from three point range. That's more like it. But quickly to the other end and the follow. How about that from Jay Crockett? Behind the back pass to Ejodas. And Ejodas loses control of it. Petaway brings it the other way. Puts it up, his third dunk in the game. Pedestal, look at Petaway. He's thinking about one thing and one thing only. And now six on the shot clock. Connor Pettis drives in and banks it in. And they've got their biggest lead of the game. Petaway hands it off. And an easy one going up Marvin Jones. Boatwright, shot clock winding down. Endure again, has to go to work. Back to Boatwright, it's a long three. Good! Not so much in the second, or in that third quarter, but here he is, back in the game. He puts up a three. Good! Mysteri. They've gone back on top by six. Anything can happen if they can just stay alive. They've got to stay alive. Benson gets it off. Wow! Big time, that was clutch. Pay a big dividend for this club. Now is the time, he needs to come up. Uh, but he's trying to defend Pedway and Crockett is the man of the hour. But at this stage, whoever's open has to take it. Here's Galvac, he gets open, he takes it, and hits another three, and now it's a six point game with 109 remaining. Now you're thinking about a three from Galvac again. Oh, he takes the foul, he makes it! Unbelievable! Trey McLean commits the foul and Gaud and it's Petaway who rebounds it, brings it up, takes the three-pointer, misses it, doesn't matter, Crockett gets a deserved cheap two points. Well, tip your hat to Petaway at the end. He made a couple of big drives.